Hey YouTube, I just saw a video on uh, Facebook and you know I don't take any word you know for granted and I saw a guy going out and picking up some snow with a spoon and put it in a bowl and put it in his kitchen and then he put a lighter to it and this is snow now I want you to pay attention to what's happening the so-called geoengineers are claiming that they are spraying to slow down global warming but now pay attention to this this is a lighter and the lighter works pretty good now watch this I can smell burnt look at that now we're supposedly to think that there should be some water down here right on the plate right in some form or fashion but look at the sodding this is the particulates what the heck are they spraying let me do it again it should melt immediately right but I can smell sodding and you can see smoke I believe I hope but it's not melting it don't become water at all you see it's just sodding and there is no water you see there's the only water but that's because of the ice cube I took an ice cube from the freezer this is a regular ice cube now let's watch this experiment let's see what happens you see that drips you see that immediately and you can see the water now let's toss that out clear the plate let's do it again snow regular snow as you see it is snow right from the garden just taken straight in now what's this you see that it don't drip it don't melt it just becomes sodded let me lift up the camera a little let's make sure you see this voila let's do this correct voila this is the snow right you can see it's snow it fall apart like snow you see that it's supposed to melt straight in my hand let's burn it again with the lighter watch it don't even drip it don't drip people at all look at that all it does it become black and it just diminishes in size let's take the ice cube again you can see this is a regular ice cube right I hope you can let's put the light on this one and what do we see what happens immediately can you see that it drips water of course because ice is frozen water water comes in three stages and that is in gaseous form meaning vapor from heat it comes in fluid as in water that comes out of your faucet and it comes in solid in form of ice but snow 
is a ice particle, but as a crystal, because it's raindrops falling from the sky in extreme cold, and they create these beautiful shapes you see that snow comes in. Let's do it again on the snow. Oh. I want you to go out and do this yourself because I didn't believe my own eyes when I saw that video. Where is the drippage? All you get is a sod trail. It don't melt. It should melt. Let's take another piece. You see there's a little tippet there, sitting there. Let's see, let's put it on straight there. What happens? All it does is become black. This is cold to hold on. Very cold. It it feels like snow. It acts like snow. Kind of frozen. Now let's take it in where it's more exposed, in small, uh, you know, fluffy. And let's put the liner on again. Pay attention. I want to make sure you absolutely see this. Where is the drop? Where is the drop at all? All that happens is it diminishes in size and then becoming black. Like there is some kind of particulates in this that can burn. But you don't see anything drip off. Do you? Not at all. I would almost say, don't touch the snow people. This is the ice cube. Right? Let's put it on again. Now, what's, what's happening? Immediately. The ice is melting and become fluid, meaning it becomes the fluid state of water. As I said, water comes in three stages, as vapor, steam, and it comes in fluid, as you see dripping off here, and it comes in solid, as ice. This is snow. From my garden. Nothing happens. It don't drip. There's no drippage. What the hell is this? Uh, excuse my language. What the hell is this? It's covering our land. It's giving us a lot of trouble and a lot of death on the roads. And it's supposedly to look like snow. And everybody believes we just have a serious nasty winter. But what's coming down from our sky? It's freaking not snow, people. It's something else. And I'm not entirely sure that is healthy for your children to play in, to be honest. You know, children playing in the snow, and they also put snow in their mouth. I did that when I was a kid. Have a funny taste to it, but that was before chemtrails were even invented. So what is this? I'm kind of shocked. I had to, I had to see this for myself. I had a hard time believing what he was just doing. And I have the uh, source to his video underneath. But let me do it again. This is the snow from the garden. Been thawing a little, and then it frozen over again, and that's why it comes in a little more solid state. And all that happens, it diminishes in size, it don't really melt away, and it leaves a sod trail. Take the ice again, right? You can clearly see this looks like ice. Now there's some of this particulates on it, you see? Let's take that off, and only leave the ice, like that. This is an ice cube from my freezer. And what happens immediately? It drips. What the hell are they spraying, people? 
Now you need to get really, really serious and really, really concerned about what they're spraying in our sky. This is not just some freaking hoax, people. The snow is not melting. Do you understand what I'm saying? Do you understand English? The snow is not melting. It's supposed to melt and become water or in fluid state. And it's supposed to drip. There are no drippage. All there is is a sud trail. What are they spraying? This is not snow. This is something artificial. Look at it. You see that? What are we dealing with here? This needs to stop. You need to be very concerned now. Very concerned. And I'm not kidding. You need to be concerned. You need to ask some serious questions. And you need to go to your city halls, to your governors and senators. And then you need to make them come. this come to a stop. This is not snow. It feels cold like snow, but it can't melt and it can't drip. All that happens is it leaves a sud trail. What is it? I'm burning a lighter here with approximately 800 Celsius degrees. And you see the ice cube is reacting instantaneously to that. Right? It drips. It drips off. You see that? This stuff don't drip, don't melt. And this would melt even faster because this is full of air, meaning there's less mass in this. This would vanish in a second with a lighter of 800 Celsius degrees on it instantaneously. It should go way faster. I should be left with nothing in a heartbeat. Ice cube again. You see, it's melting off. Immediately. Immediately. And this is water coming from the faucet. Well water. Reverse osmosis. It's water. I don't know what that is. That's not snow. It feels cold like snow. It looks like snow. It feels like snow. And all it does, it just diminishes in size and leave a sod trail like there's some something in it. Let's do it again here. You see it in fluffy. And this would just melt away and, min and become water. Right? Oh, now we have a drippage. Wow! How can that be? Oh, I can see that. That's because it's not airy anymore. Now you see it condenses. So, what is in the snow? What is in the snow? Since it can do this. It should melt like the ice cube, and even faster, but it don't. You need to be concerned about this, especially your children. God bless you.